Hi. Hi. Shantae, hi. 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 <laughs> we are at the TWA hotel and this bitch is fire. And R. And R. And R. <laughs> I'm so excited to see how the room looks like. Oh, Bro. Do a room Yo, no, nah, definitely. Oh, I wonder if we'll have like a view of the runway. Cause that would be a fucking chew. Oh my gosh. Dun, dun, dun. The photographer, the designer, and the stylist. Purr, the game's all here. Yeah. <laughs> First outfit, turn it around. Perry is. Wait, let me get you up. <laughs> we love to see. No. <laughs> <laughs> First, the first, um, first 
couple of months was just groundwork and you know setting myself up and now it's just like okay now it's time we're we're looking hot we're feeling good summer is here we're tan as fuck now it's time to put in some work okay so i'm just ah, ah, I'm so excited man just i love you guys for being on this journey with me and just watching my growth because i'm nowhere near the person i want to be i'm nowhere near the life that I want to be living and all of that and all of that um, but guys I'm just so excited and just the fact that I'm growing and you guys are watching this transformation process with me <laughs> so yeah um, yeah that's all I wanted to say but I'm gonna work this body out get my nails done today is i'm on a time crunch gotta make sure i get my nails done um before i go to work and yeah guys um have a great rest of your time and uh, we'll get into the next transition hey what's up we What is up guys? Today is Friday, July 9th, July 8th, Friday, July 8th, I believe. Um, my birthday is coming up, a lot of things are coming up. Going to Colorado next week, Denver in particular. And then right when I come back, it's my birthday. And then I'm going to Miami for my friend's birthday. Ah! Earlier, I had a call with my coach went to the gym, did some errands, and now I'm here. And I wanna show y'all a little food haul because like, honestly, who doesn't like a food haul? So, a lot of you know, I am plant-based. I just, as of recently, started to implement seafood in my eating habits. I don't really wanna use the word diet, but in my eating habits. I started to implement seafood. Um, I don't wanna, I, my whole goal isn't to eat seafood all the time, just like here and there, uh, but I'm mostly plant-based. Um, so let's get right into it. I got this, just a snack on. You know, it's really good, it's vegan. They have two grams of protein. I was looking for more protein, which there was, but I just grabbed that. So today, I might, I might make a video. I might make a cooking video, but I'm gonna be making some Alfredo pasta for the first time. So I got these, this cauliflower spaghetti um, for the sauce. I've never had this before, this vegan Alfredo pasta. And then I'm going to be adding sun-dried tomatoes to it. Mushroom. Then I got cream cheese, vegan. This one is really good. Yogurt, just egg. Really good egg alternative. So is chickpea flour, but this tastes and has the consistency more of eggs. Besides tofu. Rice cake. Oatmeal. I love oatmeal so much. These are my favorite bagels. Not so much the brand. I've had their bread. They're my favorite brand for like slices of bread. Never had their bagels, but I'm pretty sure it's good. Um, but I need to say cinnamon raisin bagel is my favorite. The cow mix. New location. Sorry if you can't hear me that well. My AC is on and it's really hot. So yeah, but um, I just wanted to come on here because <clears throat> I'm feeling inspired. Let me put this down. Um. I'm 
feeling very inspired because you know my birthday is coming up I'm gonna be 23 years old meaning new experiences new growth new challenges new problems all of that shit and I was while I was in the car I was reflecting like this this journey this growth journey is hard it's so hard and it's like I want to grow so much like I y'all don't know how bad I want to get to the next level because I'm gonna be honest I'm not satisfied with who I am right now I'm grateful for the experiences that shaped me into who I am now because I'm even more motivated I'm I'm even more inspiring I'm you know doing all the things that I need to do in order to get to that next level that next stage of my life but you know there's definitely a lot of things that I need to work on a lot of things I need to put more focus on and all of that and it's like I I need to and I always remind myself that I'm exactly where I need to be I'm exactly where I need to be in this exact moment yes even though I want to be over there but this is where I exactly need to be and it's like when you're in the journey when you're experiencing you know the shifts and you're you're on the road of getting there it's like is it even gonna happen are you even gonna get there are you even gonna become this person when is it gonna happen all these things start to appear within our minds and sometimes that can distract us and that can pull us away from the whole point of the process of the journey and it's just so beautiful I, I, I've been feeling like a little emotional or whatever, but I'm just ready, guys. I'm just in this process of readiness. <laughs> and, you know, it's not my timing. It's God's timing to for everything to come into place and all of that. But also, he's waiting on me, too. So we're both we're both in this together um but yeah that's all i wanted to share with you guys um later like i said i have a lot of things to edit to get done uh so today's gonna be very intentional i want to spend it alone with me myself my energy <sighs> spend some time with god give him some grace give myself some grace and i'll catch you guys later grace. um yeah guys let's keep growing thank you for being on this journey with me again i am appreciative of you of you and all of you um for just believing in me having faith in me and just you know being on this journey with me all in all hey guys if he, i told you the journey i just went on just to get a gift for myself <laughs> you guys wouldn't believe me could have killed some people could have gotten to uh, some car crashes maybe i'm exaggerating but we're here and you're like, what did you gift yourself, Jasmine? Well, let me tell <laughs> Red velvet! Cake! Oh my god, guys. Like, y'all. I've been craving cake ever since, like, weeks. And, you know, for all the hard work that I've been putting in and the sacrifices I've been doing, I'm like, I think it's 
time to treat myself. And I'm not gonna eat it because I need to make dinner and this is like dessert. You know, I'm gonna watch a cute little movie, spend some time with myself, but best believe I'm getting this. It was like a small chunk. Let me show you. All right, dear. Just like, oh my god. Ah! Hold on. Hold on. Y'all. This cake, I love red velvet cake, first of all. Oh my god. Oh my god. So good. And it's vegan, too. Vegan. I'm so thankful and grateful that freaking they opened up a new vegan spot near my house because the area I live in is very lacking in vegan spots so the fact that they opened it and they sell cake and they sell vegan seafood and steak and cheese everything's vegan <laughs> so excited but let me get out of this parking lot before one of these drivers near me comes and is like girl you don't know how to park see being a new driver i hate it <laughs> i cannot wait until i'm a pro at this because y'all if i told you yeah